guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Vario Land 2. Oh, that was actually kind of weird, but I'm spinning X. Let's go defeat Bobo. Oh, man. Um, I'm too used to. Damn it. Um, uh, just a second. Just a second. I seriously just got off recording Donkey Kong King Swing, and I tried to move with like, the R buttons, and they don't even exist in this game. And let me just kind of get a feel for how I'm supposed to do. Oh, I remember. I get this. If I can jump. There you go. I'm kind of getting into this. Uh, God. Okay. I'm kind of getting uh, too far ahead of myself. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna jump down here with it. There you go. And then if I just get him right over here, I can take through the jump off him. Yay! Like 33 coins, and then death to you, and that's 31. So I have 70 coins already. Jeez. Well, it's, it is a boss level. Boss levels tend to go that way. I needed you, didn't I? Um, well, evidently not. Oh, God, I hate these so much. Ugh. Okay. Don't even bother trying to get that one coin there. It's impossible. It basically sits there to tease you. I hate... It just gives you a reason to hate it even more. <gasps> okay. That's 101, and this is nerve-wracking because I don't want to lose my money. Because there's really no point in going after that if, unless I don't want unless I want the money. Okay. Um, I know there's a secret somewhere over here. It took me a little bit to actually find the the chest for this world, and I don't want to miss it because I don't like beating bosses. Okay. Um, I I forgot that was a ledge. Okay. And you. Okay. Then I'm pretty sure I still need you. So if you'd like to come back out here, that'd be nice. And let's go over here, and, um, yes I do, see? I'm smart, I remember things, I haven't done a practice run. So, I remember the, I really don't even remember what the boss is, because Bobo sounds like, not familiar at all. Oh my god. Sorry you guys right now, I found a duck. That's a mood right there. <laughs> How are you guys right now? I found a duck. And, oh, I get it. I think that might be it, I need to jump up. For no, no, I'm gonna use you if it's the last thing I do, you fucking duck! Okay. <laughs> okay, then I can just like throw you through here because I'm a cr I hate you. And you, I also hate. And by you, I also hate. I mean, I, it was you I hated originally, and they took it out on your little friend that was trying to kill me as well. And it looks like there's something over there, but I think it's just because I dropped down with this guy. This guy, Mr. Boxer Dude, let's go and break you against this wall that apparently only you can destroy. And this sound is being really messed up. Okay, now if I can just get out of here, get over here, and I think I found the door. Yeah, I think it was. I wasn't so much of a problem of did I kill it or did it respawn? Yeah, but it wasn't really so much of a problem of me not being able to find it. I think I just didn't notice it and was just like, why am I being an idiot? But 246 coins, we shouldn't. Okay. Easy mode. Easy mode this time. I will at least keep that being able to do easy all the time. I don't care as long as I don't have to come back for them. Okay, let's see, and this is a fire breathing dragon fox dude. Yeah. Have we seen them yet? We might have. Okay, where are you though? Um, there you go. You know what kind of reminds me of? It kind of reminds me of a, uh, combination of an, an anteater and like a, uh, what is this picture? And like a, uh, is it called a doll fan? I don't know. Not like a dolphin, like a dolph. Like, f is it called Fanty? I think. I don't know. Uh, Fanty's in uh, Pokemon, the little thing that rolls up and does stuff. You know, I'm not. If I, hopefully, I'm not crazy. I mean, that is my favorite Pokemon game, Crystal. Well, Gold too, to some extent, but it was it was mostly Crystal, which was the one I didn't lose and be stupid. And I wonder if I, there's anything up here. No, there was. Oh, well, I can do that apparently. What's that? What is that? What is this shenanigans? I just found the boss door and then over here is... Wow, that's actually... That was actually really nice. Very nice of you. That'd be funny if they like had a billion doors just like going away the entire time. But they don't. Oh, wow, it's over here too. Well... Oh, 169 coins isn't that bad and they do plan on rewarding me if I kill myself, so... Oh, it's this guy. It's not that bad. Those eyebrows though, that, that was really creepy. Okay. Yeah, you can come come get me. Come on. Come on. Come on. I want to... There you... What? No. Just pick me up. Oh! 
Right. Okay, basically you just have to hit him and then he'll his wind will come and just be like, whoa! And push you away. And I've already been up here, haven't I? Yeah, I have. Well then. <laughs> that's awkward. <laughs> Is that all the money that's in the stage? That kind of seems like a scant amount. Oh, well that's what happens. That's this is how you get back. It's not really that big of a deal. Well, actually, it's a... As far as boss, like, tedious things go, this is actually relatively long. Because, yeah, it took a little bit to get back, but it's not that bad of a boss. In fact, even being hit by him, you don't even, like, get knocked away like some of them. It's, uh, it's his wind attack, so you just need to be... Remember to high jump when you see him jump. So when he comes down at you, just smash and then duck right here. I'm not sure what this does, but it just stops, and that was... that's. Uh, and then he just changes his pattern up a little bit, so you can... Okay, well... Oh, fuck. And then you try to get back if you... God damn it. There you go. Why is it being so stupid? I wonder if it goes forever. It might. And I'm not sure if there's... Oh, well, fuck you. Um... I got you that time. Hey, it's like a fucking rooster. And that, that killed me, yeah. See, there's only like two things you need to survive, too. So I guess it's still rising you trying to figure out how to do it. I can see that being an issue, but that my first instinct when I did it was to duck. So when I ducked, it was just like, oh, I did it. That's not really that big of a deal. But yeah, that's how you beat the boss. That's how you beat, uh, Bobo, I guess. Bobo. Um, let's see what this is. That doesn't help me that much. Um, nine. Yeah, it's a nine. I think it could be a five as well. I'm guessing nine. Damn it! I was gonna complete a full row too. Eh, that's not very nice. And I don't have any money, so it wasn't even worth it. It was like two hundred dollars wasted. Okay, but Wario, well, you got to the end of the ship, and what is this? You see an escaping by a hot air balloon. Like, is it? It's like Serp the Bandits. I guess she helps you in like Warrior Land shake it and stuff, and uh, what else are the references to? Is she in any of the other games? I don't know. I'm pretty sure she's not in Warrior Land 3. Warrior Land 4, I almost guarantee that as well. I'm not sure what other game she'd be in. I'm not sure if there's anything in, uh, what, in uh, Super Mario Land 3 either. But yeah, welcome to. Owls. I love owls, actually. I really like them owls. I mean, they're not really all that creative and mechanic. But, I guess since I'm good at it, it's not really that big of an issue for me. I mean, it's just like, controlling yourself and not having to worry about... Don't worry about the owl, just worry about how you're moving. But yeah, it just controls normally. So then, here you are. Yeah, there's nothing up. Other world it might be, I don't know. It's entirely possible that there's stuff there, I just didn't bother checking. Um, coins, 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 oh, and this thing right, that thing right there, up there, you can kill it like that, apparently, I didn't even know that, I was actually just gonna demonstrate how you got, how to get caught by it, cause you don't, yeah, there you go, it takes some money from you, and you get stuck up here, but then you can kill this, and you can get up, oh, you can't get up there, I tried a lot the first time I saw it, but you cannot get up there, don't worry about it, it's okay. It's not that you're imperfect. That's not the reason at all. All of that is completely true. It's just that, uh... Okay, this one we do want to get to, but I want to get all the coins down here first. Um... Because I... Is up there the minigame? I don't even know. It might be... True? I don't know. I... I find that even after I've done these up. Uh, I'm coming back. I don't trust this. I don't want to come back. I don't want to come back to places. So you can go die. That's actually a really funny fish. Face you make fish. And if you'd like to come out Mr. Swordfish, that'd be a-okay. -A you can just jump over them. The line doesn't catch you or anything. Don't worry about that. But I will just come, hopefully, come over here and, um... Um... Come on. I don't want to have to do so much and just not know where to go. Two coins, um, 193, 194. God damn it. I want coins. Oh, jeez. Okay, that's good enough. 
Let's go back and do this mini game. Because that's what we do in games. We play games. It's like Gameception. Within the game, within the game. That's not very fun. But the first game is fun, so I don't know how they got to that conclusion. And if I lost money on this, I guess that you don't lose money when you're caught by the fish. I was thinking you were, but I guess it's supposed to be more of like an annoyance. And if any guys to lose all of our hard earned money in playing a game of chance, pretty much. Yeah. Three coins left right now. Yeah. Um, Mr. One-Eye Cyclops Monster Dude that gets really angry. Yeah. Where are you? Oh, fuck. Oh, no, he's in the same place as uh, this. Yeah. Yay! And is that an Mario Glove Warrior? You're just hold your hand upside down. Probably the second one, quite frankly. And hey, it's the seed! It's the seed. I actually like the seed. I like vines. I like climbing things. I, I, I d never really under... I shouldn't say I never understood why people didn't like climbing things, I completely understand that, especially in platformers, but I don't know, I, I think there's a charm to getting up really high, and it's it's the falling part that people don't like. And if you'd like to just go like this, that'd be easy and it'll kill you too, just to make you feel better. So, Mr. Owl, wake up so I can just kind of use you, yeah. Use you to my heart this desire, you dick. See, you don't have to worry about... About uh, Wario, he'll be fine. Well, you have to worry about Wario. He was the one that won't be fine. It's the owl that can just be like, "Yo, suicidal, bro. Suicide." Ah, oh, I shouldn't make fun of that. Oh my god. I don't like these things. They're not even that visually appealing. I wish they would look at least looked cooler for all the times that they've not really killed me so much as they've tried to and just made me do more work. And you are a marshmallow. Um, where are you? Well, you're right there, so I guess I just need to... That's not really a puzzle, that's... I wish there was a puzzle there. Puzzles, I like puzzles. Puzzles are the best part of these games. So I don't understand why they just have to like put it over there and just be like, Go collect it, bitch! This is an RPG. I love RPGs too, they used to be my favorite genre. Now platformers probably are, as you guys can probably tell, because I have Link to the Past on my Let's Play channel, and then... Platformers. Pretty much, yeah, that, I think that's all I have. And I'm over here. Fine. Yeah, let's see. Warrior Land 1 and 2, Mega Man 1, Donkey Kong Game Swing, Warrior Land 2, and why the hell do I keep running into that thing? It's because I have to think. Yeah, they're all platformers. I right, go figure. Yeah, I love platformers. In fact, the game I'm, games I'm thinking about let's play next are all platformers as well, so you know I want to be up here. If you'd like to speed up. That did not serve my purpose in the slightest, and this music is so messed up when I'm recording. I feel bad about it too, because it's pretty decent mu music, and I just have to be like, new, no, I'm just going to ruin it with my recording. Oh. And that ended up not being worth it at all. <laughs> I had a 101 coins before I came here, and now I have 100. I lost one net. My net gain is pathetic. I'd go bankrupt as a company. Well, not really. I don't want to get into economics, though. Okay. Now, if you'd like to, please go down here. That, thank you. Music, stop messing up, please. I like this music. Eh. Okay. Now, um, let's go the ballsy way. And fail, I guess. I guess it'd be easier to come around the other way as well, but once I try a way, I need to do it and spend a billion bajillion years in this room. Um do 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 and just a second. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Oh, uh, let's actually try this way again, then. And if you'd like to go... Yep, we got it. We got it. Now it's kind of ballsy to try to force it all the way through. And did I find everything? I must have. And I, why did I... I don't, sorry for pausing it, like, right at the end. <laughs> I didn't realize it was that close. I decided to take care of something. That's 198... Uh, I wish I had two more. Um... Well, oh, 
So I'm concentrating just a second. Okay, thank God. And we got 48 coins left. Not that we had, a, we were gonna have that regardless, pretty much. But at least we don't have that gap anymore. Maybe I should just fail on the all of those, and then just have that huge line, and just be like, we can see the map. Why can't we just like fill it out? It doesn't matter. Ah. But anyways, guys, I think it's a pretty productive episode. In the next one, we're going to continue in Maine's words and defeat the giant spearman. Ah. Oh. Thank you guys so very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye now.